<clears throat> let me get my voice already what's up my beautiful peeps welcome back to my canal don't forget to like this video please subscribe to my youtube canal and follow me on social media i hope you guys are feeling great hope you guys are feeling positive sending you guys nothing but good vibes only for me it's morning it's not hella hella early but it's it's pretty it's morning for me so g morning g afternoon g night whatever the fuck it is for you and i already did my skincare my gua sha you know for the little inflammation but i don't really get i don't look so like each other in the mornings because you'd be looking each other if you eat like salty foods or just like junk food and i don't do that stuff i am drinking my warm lemon water i love drinking this in the mornings especially when the weather is a fucking horrible like right now I mean, I don't want to say horrible, but it's just really cloudy and grayish outside. So today, I don't have a makeup tutorial for you guys, but I have like this little, I don't know, tricks. I don't know what the fuck I would really call it. I don't know about you guys, but I like to use all of my makeup products. Like, I'm going to get all my money's worth. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to fucking throw it away. No, no, no. Like, I don't know if people throw this away where it's like... You know, there's still some there, but it's, like, not awful. No, 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 hunty. I'm gonna use all of this until I hit Pam Pam. Until I get it all. You know what I'm saying? That's the same with <laughs> these. This lip liner and this brow pencil. A lot of people just throw them away. Even with foundations, like, no, I'm gonna open this shit. I'm gonna open up the concealer and I'm gonna go in there. Till I can't no more. These are the main products I'm gonna show you guys. I just found this out. Like, this is done done i cannot go up anymore but i was thinking i was like bro there has to be some don't push it up go reverse and you're gonna hear this sound just pull it out pull it out and look at all the product that's still fucking in there well it kind of comes out oh fuck. you see all of this i could still use this like a couple more times like hella more time you can actually fucking take it out <laughs> what the fuck so there you go so it's like uh, first thing i do is my brows so let's do my brows i don't have a fucking pencil a pencil a pencil a mirror hopefully this does not come out while i'm doing it damn i need to do my brows i sound like a little bit what would you call it i don't even know what the fuck you would call it because i don't know why i woke up sneezing this morning i put on my alarm right so i could wake up and I woke up before my alarm because I woke up sneezing and then I'm like, oh shit, I have to pee. So it's not that hard to do and it's not coming off, thank God. I'm doing the thing because you guys, money, money. What the fuck? Is it like too early for me or what, bro? I usually never film this early, so maybe. <laughs> I'm like, maybe. No. Makeup is pretty expensive nowadays, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna lie. I don't go for the most expensive makeup. Hell no. If there's a product that's way cheaper, like I'm gonna get that. I don't give a fuck. I'm not just, I'm just not about brand names, you know what I'm saying? Fuck all that. I feel like the more expensive products are not even that good. They sell that expensive, but it's so low quality. Drugstore products be really it nowadays i feel like they just really stepped up their game they've always been lit to be honest i've always been into them yeah you don't have to go for the most expensive products i went to the store yesterday i went to target i bought a new juicer oh my god dude like that shit makes me so happy like that's the shit that'd be exciting me <laughs> i was so excited i already used it and it's so fucking lit oh my god i was so happy yesterday <laughs> went to the makeup section dude they have like color pop at target now i was like what color pop because that should be at all time i want to try a new eyeliner liquid eyeliner so if you guys have any recommendations let me know what's good what liquid eyeliner do you guys like i've been wanting a gel liner i've been wanting to try it like the inglot one but damn this shit's pretty expensive and i'm like eh, i don't know how i feel about gel liner just because i fuck with liquid liner now so used to it and just the gel liner you have to use a brush and then cleaning the brush and all that shit i'm just like it's just too much work and i'm like i don't know how the fuck i feel about it and then to fucking find a good brush that's gonna work i'm like i don't know but yeah look see like hunty 
Dude, I can still use that shit hella more times. Now I'm just cleaning up the brows. This ain't gonna be a tutorial tutorial. I'm just basically show you guys products like that, how I did that. You guys saw that already. You just have to fuck with it and get that product down, hunty shit. If I have to melt that shit and put it in a little thing and use a brush, I'll fucking do that too. I'ma get my money's worth. Like, I ain't playing with that shit. But anywho, I used to, dude, I don't know if you guys ever tried nyc i used to fuck with nyc back in the day they don't sell it anymore i used to get it from sears and they had the best best fucking liquid liner it was mad it didn't smear the brush was the best fucking brush i've ever used their lipsticks were really good too and after they i don't know went out of business i think so I just never fucking found it again i was so bummed out dude i was like what the fuck i've tried the nyx one and it's pretty similar to it i'm not gonna lie the matte one the brush the packaging and everything is pretty similar and i wanted to get it again i was looking at the next one yesterday and i'm like do i want this one but then there was also a waterproof one but i'm like fuck like which one do i want because i know waterproof it won't smear and i tend to like kind of my eye waters this this eye from the outer corner i don't fucking know why so it's like if i'm just wearing eyeshadow sometimes it just smears a bit or with eyeliner as well so i'm like do i want to go with the waterproof one but then i know the waterproof one it's going to be like shiny because that's how the waterproof ones be and i don't like that i like matte i just couldn't decide so i said i just didn't get nothing <laughs> i said fuck that like if i can't decide i'ma just not get anything i'm not one of those that's like oh let me just get both no hunty they were both damn near like 10 bucks fuck that for fucking liquid liner i said i still got mine i just don't really fuck with the one i got because of the brush but i said fuck it like i still make it work you know what i'm saying but let me know what's your favorite liquid liner then i went to the elf section because i have tried the elf liquid liner and honestly i really fucked with it but i didn't see it anymore they only have the pencil now like you know how it's like in the pencil and it's just like you know what i'm saying you know what i'm talking about not the like a little pen pencil form I don't like those kind because they tend to dry up really quick and the, the product just doesn't really come out and i don't like the spongy and or i just don't fuck with it so i said fuck because i really fucked with that one as well and it was cheap you know dude with makeup i always say it's not about the products but it's how the fuck you use it comment down below what's your favorite wait which one am i using what's your favorite liquid lip liquid lip oh my god it's, it must be really fucking early for me what is your favorite liquid eyeliner help your home girl out which one should i try which one's good not a fucking expensive one okay fuck that i'll probably end up going for the next one but i just don't know which one i'm gonna watch videos that's what i normally do for products like even when i started doing makeup and got into makeup i would watch youtube videos to see basically makeup reviews not so much tutorials it might be some tutorials just to see how the product really works but it doesn't help much with learning how to do your makeup you have to fucking actually practice on yourself is what i always say practice practice oh my god i cannot fucking talk practice makes perfect a technique can work for somebody else but it might not work for you all our features are different their technique might not work the same on you it's just different for everybody practice get your little kit going not such an expensive one start small and build your way up all right let me just finish this up and then i'll get to the lips and come right back and show you the weather is so it's just not sunny <laughs> it's like so cloudy and foggy but like you know that fog where like you can't really see much it's kind of like that but hopefully it doesn't rain because i am going out today not going out out but just i'm gonna be out um but yeah dude look at my natural lashes they are thriving so cute i started putting coconut oil on them dude and i've been seeing videos of where i don't know if they started showing me the videos on tiktok because i searched up natural at home diy lash serums and you can't put coconut oil and just castor oil and i've been seeing these videos where like their eyes just get sewing chavos and poofy and red and some other shit be going on if you put if you use lash serums i'm like oh. well it's because you don't know what the fuck people be putting in them you know i don't know but that shit's scary fuck all that just do it at home just dude just put some coconut oil like coconut oil is good for everything castor oil as well i love getting ready with you guys to be honest even if i'm just talking about 
I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Comment down below on topics you guys want me to talk about while I'm getting ready. Because <laughs> I could just be going on and on and on. For the lip liner, I love Juvia's Place. Y'all just know I love Juvia's Place. And it's it's done as well. You guys can see there. It doesn't go up. Do the same where you reverse it. And it goes all the way down. And then just kind of like pull this, this little top off. Pull it off, and it's going to look like this. And just, it might be a little bit hard at first, but you take it off. Look, look, look at that fucking product. Ow. In my elbow. So I'm just going to put it back in here. Let's see if it's going to stay. Nope. Yeah. You just kind of have to twist it. Twist it down. Oh, no. No, it doesn't want to come out. I think I'm just use it like that. Fuck it. I think it's not gonna work in here. So just fucking use it like this, hunty. I'm gonna fucking use it like this, dude. It's cause I'm telling you guys, I'm gonna get my fucking money's worth. You know what I'm saying? So just fucking line your lips. Even if I have to fucking take this out, let me know what fucking products. What are your tricks for products when it's like running out or when it's like done supposedly and it really isn't like i know with the concealers i take off that little plastic thingy it kind of helps with the applicator when you fill it up so all the product doesn't come up so it keeps product in there i end up taking that off so then i can get all the product that's left you know it's actually really easy to line your lips with this i actually do my makeup really fast i mean i always do <laughs> this is my easy everyday makeup look and it's only fucking powders and i didn't put hella product on my forehead just a little bit you could kind of tell briscas do like my skin is just so flawless <laughs> not a brag or anything but it really is and it just looks so smooth when i apply the powders like it really just gives me that skin finish look and it looks so i know it's not natural because it's makeup ov but it gives me a natural finish you know or it doesn't look too cakey or too much you know, I love to overline my lip. I don't know about y'all, but I love that little plump effect. But also because my lips are not symmetrical. And I like to make them look like they are. I know they won't look symmetrical, symmetrical, but that's just the power of makeup. And it's just so cool. But here it is. And now I'm gonna just... Where's my chopstick? Shit. Let me know if you guys end up using these little tricks. Did you guys already know this? Did you guys use this? I was just fucking with that. Because I'm like, dude, how is it that it's done? Like, is it really done? Because I know it's not. I just know how it is with foundations and concealers. So I said, let me do a little something. Let me play with this and see. Let me see what I can do. How much more product there is. I was shook because there's still some fucking product in there. Alright, well this is it this is the look i'm not gonna do my hair because i'm gonna just wear a fucking beanie i was gonna do my hair i was gonna do a ponytail but it's cold and my ears are just going to get cold and i'm just gonna feel more cold so i'll just cover up with a beanie so this is it <laughs> should i let it down and just give you guys a little <laughs> since i was sneezing i was like fuck do i really want to get ready or not but i ended up getting ready because i'm like i woke up early and i said i was gonna do it so let's fucking do it thank you so much for watching this video i really appreciate you guys tuning in and checking these tricks out let me know if you guys tried these tricks i don't know i'm calling them little tricks let me know if you guys try them out comment down below what you do you know when like your concealer is done or just anything like that i don't fucking know are you also the same where you are trying to get your money's worth. Because shit, I am. I fucking am for anything, bro. Like, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.